Hello YouTube, this is Rob from Rob's Custom Creations. This is part three of the Y sequels on my 2012 Ford Mustang. This is a video on the lighting I installed on my 2012 Ford Mustang. This video is a presentation on different applications of lighting that can be installed on your vehicle to give it a customized look. First, I installed certain lights to come on automatically when I press the unlock feature on my car remote. I chose to install my lights in this manner because I wanted the lights to come on when I press the unlock button on my remote. Especially if I am in low lit areas so that I can find my car more easily and so I can have plenty of light to see where I'm going. By installing the lights in this manner, my lights also come on when the parking lights are on, allowing me to use these lights as daytime driving lights. This is a safety feature because drivers on the road are more prone to see me when I'm driving because of the lights as opposed to not having them. I've noticed drivers pay more attention to my car when I'm on the road due to the lights I have on. I installed my lights to come on when the parking lights are on and when I press the unlock button on my remote by connecting them to the Mustang side lights in the front of the vehicle. The negative and positive terminals can easily be found by using a multimeter. And here's a close up of where I tap into the side light wiring. And if it'll focus, there we go. And that's how I connected them. I placed a blue LED 4 inch strip centering it on the driver and passenger side doors and securing it to the undercarriage of the car. I connected these lights to the front side lights of the Mustang as well. I view this more as a safety feature because in, in complete darkness I can see the ground and the placement of my feet when I'm entering my car. And that is an example or presentation of the four inch blue LED strips that I have placed on the driver and passenger side doors and they are secured to the undercarriage of the vehicle and light up when I press the unlock button on my remote or when I have the parking lights or the lights of the vehicle on. And that's what it looks like. I place a 14 inch white LED strip of lights on the headlight splitters. here there we go I installed these lights by connecting them to the front side lights of the Mustang so that they turn on when I press the unlock button on my remote and also turn on when I have my parking lights turned on I did this because I wanted to give it a unique and custom look and I'll demonstrate that again now I'll go turn the car on there we go
also as you can tell I have some blue light strips under the front fender of the vehicle another light that I installed on the vehicle inconspicuously and hit it in the grill of the car is a light that I strictly use when I'm at car shows to attract people especially when you're at a car show at night to the car which is quote unquote the uh, Knight Rider light and I went ahead and installed this light uh, with a remote so I can turn it on and off um, whenever I need to have it on or have it off but most of the time I have it off like I said I strictly use this light for car shows and I'll demonstrate that right now and I'll turn it off yes I used to be a Knight Rider fan remember I am just presenting different ideas that I use to install different types of lights to my car. I hope that you have enjoyed this presentation on different applications of lighting that can be installed on your vehicle to give it a customized look. For more videos like this, watch my channel. Thanks for watching and as always, please share, like, and subscribe.